we have to find a better way. We have to find ways to reach children that the public school, the brick and mortar schools don't work for. The past year has been hard for Idaho students. Families had to adapt, and Idaho stepped up by creating strong families, strong students. Now we need your help to support families. This is a story of why. When school shut down last fall, the merging of parenting and education wasn't pretty in my house. So that's what kind of led us to finding a different alternative model. Something where it's more like a homeschool, but we're not doing it on our own. When we had our first meeting for the pod, um, we really just wanted to support our school and our teachers because we loved where they were, we loved our teachers. I felt out of control of my, in my children's education and starting this pod, I was able to regain that control and take that back and it felt very empowering for me and it's very empowering for my kids. I have three kids in the pod. I have a fifth grader, a fourth grader, and a second grader. My second grader is ahead of the game. He's doing second grade work, but he's getting hundreds consistently across the board. This is the light in the darkness for me because I've learned so much about myself and what I can and cannot do, and I've learned about my children and what they can and cannot do and what they're capable of. So strong students, strong families, we all applied for it first day. If we had access to funding right now, there's a lot more things we could be doing, providing a higher level of education for our kids. I come from a family of teachers. Um, my dad's a teacher, my mom's a teacher, my aunts and uncles are teachers, everybody's teachers. And um, I think the biggest thing would be for them to realize that you don't have to keep doing it the same way. Idaho families need resources to pay for things like tutoring and career training. They need school to be flexible so their kids can learn at their own pace. And all Idaho students should get credit for what they learn outside school walls. There are so many options, so many ways to innovate. Not every child's the same. We have to find a better way. We have to find ways to reach children that the public school, the brick and mortar schools don't work for. Idaho parents should be trusted to make decisions about their children's education. Because it's not about the system, it's about the students. It's about the kids. We want to transform education for every Idaho kid. Yes, every kid. Call your legislator and tell them to support the Strong Students Bill.